Yo guys, Reggie with two G's here. I love how I introduce myself. Yo guys, Reggie with two G's here. I think none of you guys know who I am. Who's watching this right now? I mean, it says my name right down there. I've got my little icon right there. Hell, it even has my name like right in the title screen right now. Ready with two G! Two G! Ready with two G! Ready with two G! Ready with two G! Ready with two G. Anyways, any waste? I want to talk to you guys today about winter riding. Now, <clears throat> today on Bridging with Two G's, we are going to discuss winter riding. Winter riding consists of riding in the snow. And Reggie with Two G's is going to talk about riding in the snow. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> That's two ways. That's two ways. Ah, ah, ah. What the heck has gotten into me lately? Um, I want to talk to you guys about winter riding. Um, seeing as I live in Florida, I, 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 I ain't got to worry about no winter riding. I don't have to because uh, it just gets cold here. It doesn't snow. So I decided I would talk about, as a moto vlogger for the winter time, what you should do to prepare. This is all hypothetical because I don't live where it's cold or it gets cold enough to worry about winter and having to put my bike up because uh, I ride my bike all year. Um, so what the first bit of advice I would give somebody if they're moto vlogging, if they're going to start moto vlogging, they live somewhere up north where it might, I don't know, rain, don't start moto vlogging. That was easy enough. Because if you start now, in the winter time, you know what's going to happen? You are going to quickly run out of material when it starts to snow, and then you're left with nothing but um, no nothing post in between your vlogs. Um, now, if you're already established, or if you've been doing this, you know, starting in the spring, my advice to you is whatever schedule you have, I would modify it. So let's say. You're a type of dude that just films stuff and puts it out randomly. I would start to stockpile stuff. If it was me and I was recording, first of all, I, I, I post videos twice a week. I would, at a certain point, downgrade to once a week. I'd be like, hey guys, this is Reggie. I'm gonna have to downgrade my videos to once a week. Confederate flag. Ugh. And um, I down, have to downgrade it to once a week. And um, that way I could stretch out my videos so the weather got better. And that way I'd give the, the people something to watch. I would give the, I would give the people something to watch. Um, you know, my subs on my channel during the winter time. Another good idea, another good idea is to do a hangout. That's a nice bike. Man, I, I must be the only dude who appreciates all oh, uh, well, I'm not the only dude, but <sighs> that is a freaking sweet bike. Anyway, right now it's Biketoberfest, so in case you're wondering, um, I would I would start stockpiling stuff just so I had something in case. Oh, that was up. Oh, there is a spider web on my helmet. That was weird. I thought it sucked to get a spider web in my face while I was going down the road. Dude, what the fuck are you doing, dude? What the heck? There's a turning lane right there, dude. You might want to use it. Um, but yeah, I, I, that's what I would do. I would get like enough videos, like whether they're 12 or 15 videos, edit them. I would do fun stuff. Hell, I would even start doing hangouts. You know, that's a good way to keep your your subscribers engaged. And that 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 is something that I would that I would definitely consider doing. Like I don't do one already, but that way because I think a lot of subs 
don't sub people for their bikes. I think they sub people because they like people. You know, they like the person and they, they happen to be riding a bike, which is an interest they share. But I think after a while, you become invested in the person. So let's say you couldn't stockpile videos and you couldn't, um, what's the word I'm looking for? You couldn't do hangouts. Or you ride or, or you just can't put videos out like on your bike because it's snowing or whatever updates would be cool you know just give people little life updates about what's going on with you because honestly most of the motor vloggers or a lot of the motor vloggers I watch I watch them for for who they are you know I, I if I went through the list of subscribers that I watch and what they ride you know, they all ride different things. They're all different. That's how I look at it. Sweet Honda. Reggie, there's only six gears. Stop shifting. So, anyway, let me know what you guys think. Any of you guys who live in a cold weather state, what your plans are if you're just going to shut down for the winter. Um, it definitely sucks as someone who likes to watch moto vlogs when you have a lot of guys just shut down for the winter because then your feed really starts to slow down. But, you know, it can't be helped. Definitely when I want to be safe and get through the winter, okay? Anyway, I'm going to get off here before uh, before I ramble on too long and go tangent crazy. And um, I'll catch you guys on the next video. Adios!